This is interesting as well. This is from Browns Wire. Five Bills free agents who could follow Ken Dorsey to the Browns. Uh, they go a couple of wide receivers. We begin with Gabe Davis. Um, had a little bit of a down year. Was banged up in the playoffs. Uh, another wide receiver, uh, Trent Sherfield, who um, Browns were rumored to be interested in when he was a free agent and he signed with the Bills. Offensive lineman David Edwards, uh, then a couple of running backs, uh, Damian Harris, um, as well as Ty Johnson. Ty Johnson kind of um, ha had some success later um, in the regular season and a little bit in the playoffs uh, for the Bills. When you look at those, the, the wide receivers intrigue me. I, I don't know that any of them are kind of a big name. Those I don't think any of those are, are – um, you know, none of them are going to break the bank as free agents, I guess. Yeah, you know, I mean, the, the running backs, you could see that because they're going to have to, the Browns are going to have to add somebody to that room, right? We don't know what's going on with Nick Chubb. We expect Kareem Hunt to leave. Um, Gabe Davis is the guy on that list that really piques my interest because I know they haven't been thrilled with him in Buffalo, right? He's supposed to be the number two to Diggs, and he had the kind of the big year, I want to say, in 21, especially in the playoffs, big playoffs. But it hasn't built on that success. I think he's been banged up, at least in 22. I think he was banged up. But he's a guy that flies. And he's kind of a big body. And, you know, I, I, we've talked about it, Dave. I think the Browns need some, somebody who can stretch the field. And I, I don't know if they're going to pay two guys a bunch of money. And if they're committed to Amari Cooper is the one guy, okay, then that means they're not going to go pay somebody else big money. At least that's what I think. So is Davis a guy that fits a couple of needs and isn't going to break the bank? That that interests me. And then the experience with Dorsey. Um, so I, I kind of like that name. It's a name that I kind of I had filed away in my head uh, even before we saw that. 